you guys welcome back to my channel oh, as soon as i start let me put that on mute okay so welcome back to my channel guys today i'm going to be doing a edge tutorial um i think it's been like a month or almost two months since i posted um i'm gonna do an update video but i'm gonna do that for like the 2020 like the first video of 2020 i'm gonna do that video so um to do my edges this is what i use oh wait before i get into the video make sure you guys like comment subscribe um share this video with the people that don't know how to do their edges so the first thing i well the only thing i use is a brush like this let me get the focus okay i use a brush like this and the comb sometimes and I use this edge control. Um, sometimes I use a toothbrush if I don't got this type of brush. And for edge control, I, I pretty much just always use this one. I've always used this one for a Gorilla Snot. But I ran out of my Gorilla Snot before I went back to Indiana. And I ain't buy none, I just bought this. So um, I'm gonna zoom y'all in so y'all can see my rough edges. And I'm just gonna talk y'all through what I do. So let's jump into it. Yeah, so don't mind my eyebrows. I'm gonna do an eyebrow video. Oops. Okay, that's good. So these are my edges. So first I just start by like brushing the comb them out down so they can already be like combed out. So I just brush, I just comb them out. I'm brush my eyebrows first of all, hold on. Okay, so yeah, I brush my edges out like this so they can already be like Going the way I want them to go. Brush them out, brush them out, brush them out. Now these braids, I had them in since Thanksgiving, so they getting, they getting there. So that's why I got so much edge out, but it's okay. Okay, so when I brush them out, I'm gonna put some product on them a little bit. Uh, I don't go edge by edge, I just put it on like this let's see so I just rub it down the way I want it to go just put a little on for right now well I don't know if this little y'all are loud, like they loud because they watching something so ignore that but I don't know if it's a little to y'all or a lot but this is what I do I just put some on so they can stay okay so this is how they're gonna look right now. Okay, so once I do that, I go in with the brush. Sometimes I use a comb if they like nappy, but I try to brush first. So I'm gonna start with the, my widow's peak. I like this to go to the right. So this is what I do. I brush it down and swoop it up into my hair I like that and then brush it down well usually I take the end of that suit and then I make that the next little baby hair so I brush that edge down I use my finger uh, right behind the brush because I feel like that's what makes it stick to your head when you reuse your finger after it. So that's what I do. Make a little swoop. I hold this, I hold it like this so I can get that swoop action. Okay, so after I do that, I go to the next one. I use the the, the bottom, well the back of the little curl. Sometimes I swoop it down for the next one. Sometimes I comb it up like this because that little piece needs to go up. So I do it like that. And like just push push it into the hair. It looks bad right there because it's coming out, but you can always put a little bit on there to lay it down like that. And then just do it again. Brush it into the back like that. And then this one, brush it. Brush down, swoop it into the hair. For the edges, you I don't know. Sometimes I go 
straight down like this and sometimes I push it back in here. It just depends on how much hair is out. So it's like a decent amount, so I'm gonna push it back. So I brush it down and follow it with my finger. Oh, this is actually look cute this way. So I'm gonna leave it out. Yep. And that hair comes back there. So I just brush it down. So that's that side of the edges. Looking pretty good. One side always looks better than the other, but I'm gonna try to get it to look both good. So now I'm right handed, so I'm gonna keep using my right hand. And I just brush, brush down. Oh, that's too big. Sometimes it gets stuck. I gotta comb it up, but I brush it and like that. Sexy. I like that one. Okay, brush it. See, this is coming together, clumping together, so I'll use a comb to comb it out. Then do the same thing, brush it. The soup is here. Like that. And then. I'm gonna do this one. This is a lot of hair left out. So I'm gonna try to brush it first, but I might have to comb it. I'll just brush it down first. It needs to be combed, so. It's like it's not that much product on it, so I'm gonna put that behind my ear. Okay. So this is kind of dry, so I'm gonna add some more. And I just brush it towards my face and swoop it. Sometimes you need the comb to get the bottom part to look good. So yeah, that's how I do my edges. And this is what they turn out to look like. Sometimes this one looks trash, but you can always fix it. Just brush it till you like it. Some people do their edges differently, but this is how I do mine. I like mine to like look like waves. Like sometimes I like it to look like this and go down to the next one, or sometimes I leave it like this and then make a new one. And sometimes people like this curly, but sometimes I don't like doing it, so I just leave it like that. So that's how I do my edges, and then to lay them, lay them, I use this scarf. So I just take my scarf like this, fold it. I just fold this one because it's a big scarf. Do like that, and then boom. I look like this. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna just tie it for a second. And then I just do like this to make it stick. So yes, that's how I do my edges, y'all. And once again, I told y'all I use this. This edge stuff. Upside down, yep. This edge stuff, it, it works good for me. And but for the summertime, I really use the Gorilla Snot because this hold, but the Gorilla Snot hold more. And this was six dollars. And then I use this. Now every time I use it, so it don't get clumped up. Every time I use it, I wash it. Hold on, let it focus. Every time I use this, I always wash this out so it's not like hard and stuck in there. So I always wash this out and wash the comb part out. I don't really use this. Sometimes I do, but. Sometimes I just use this in. Let me zoom y'all out. Okay, usually I let it sit till I'm leaving for wherever I'm going. So I'm just going to take it off for the sake of the video.
So yeah, y'all, this is how I do my edges. Um, I don't do them all the time, just cause I don't be feeling like it. But when I do do them, this is how they look. And my sister did my hair, by the way, if y'all didn't know her. Instagram is Styles by Nave, but I know she got like a underscore in there somewhere. Hold on, wait, hold on. If y'all want to do y'all braids, hit her up. She's in the Maryville or um, Terra, Terra Hope. She go to ISU, so she in that area. So just hit her up and she'll book y'all. I mean, yeah, she'll book y'all. This is her Instagram, underscore styles by nay dot underscore. So yeah, she, she always does my hair. That's the only person that does my hair. Okay, so that's the end of the video, y'all. Um, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Um, share the video. Let me know what other videos y'all want me to do in the future. Uh, whether it be beauty videos or just like, I don't know, Q&A's or something like that. I don't know. Tags. Um, so yeah, that's the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys for my next video. Peace, y'all.